Hello, Model Railroad fans. Uh, this is a brief uh, little uh, how-to video before I show you uh, one of my trains running. So I have to change this uh, turnout here because this uh, snap switch burn out. So I have another smell I can put under here. So to get this disconnected, I first wet down all the ballast, let that soak in real good, and then scraped it out. And then I took out these first two ties. I cut them in half, and then I used my X-Acto knife to saw underneath and uh, cut the underneath part of the plastic. Then I pushed back the joiners with my screwdriver. I have a little screwdriver that works real well for that. So then I can just lift this turnout up. And uh, the other thing I do is I had to drill a little hole for the turnout uh, switch motor wire to come up through. This is an older turnout. It didn't have a hole in it. So I drill that down through there so I can then know where to drill my half inch hole down through there. So the wire on the uh, switch motor has room to throw back and forth. Just a little video. You've seen my B and O coal cars, so I'd been searching for a B and O locomotive, and I ran across this steam locomotive, and uh, thought it looked good. And the seller said it was DCC. Well, I got it. It's not DCC. It's ready for DCC, but it does not have a decoder. And while I can run DC locomotives on my layout with a with a toggle switch, I really can't run my uh, turnouts, my DCC turnout. So I'm probably not going to keep this loco. I'll just turn around and sell it back on eBay. Thanks for watching.